Hello all. Exotic fish number three has entered the chat this week in the cistern on Nessus. It's called the Vexing Placoderm and pushes us one step closer to the Pond Pals emblem. This also means we get to slam dunk another thrall statue for Zebra Ra to have yet another problem with us. Bring your violence. Oh man, just living out my fishing dreams here. So, after Iron Jesus blesses you from up high, go and actually slam dunk your effort into your aquarium and get a broken blade of ambition. As seen, last week's blade has stayed, so once we get next week's, it seems we may need to slam all statues in one run and do something extra in that same run possibly. Anyway, head into a deep dive and clear the first encounter with or without a pressure trial active. Once done, go to the outside area and turn left instead of going to the next area and you'll find a now open door with your statue. The whetstone waits. Bring your violence like a wave against my stones. Almost there. Because you can never have enough fishing, Hawthorne has another fishing rally quest, this time for Nessus, with the same rewards like last week. As seen on the bait, the throne world has also stayed as an exotic fish location so you aren't locked out from getting the moth car. Aside from fishing, this is the last week of main story for the season and future story is dropped upon us, likely for next season so go check out the neat cutscene and get a new exotic sparrow. For the rest of the game, Braytek Osprey is back and can be gotten from the PsyOps Battleground Moon Nightfall, which is definitely a tough one, especially on that GM. Grasp of Avarice is the featured dungeon and King's Fall is the featured raid, both featuring their master modes. Over on Neomuna, Ahimsa Park is the vexed incursion zone with its partition and the weekly mission is Breakneck. For Root of Nightmares, Scission will have its challenge active, that is Encounter 2. Also, apparently there is bonus to Trials Rep this week, which Destiny the Game shared on Twitter, but wasn't in the next week in Destiny card, so we'll see on the weekend. And Eververse, yes, I know, has a rare ornament in the form of the powerful statement ornament for Loaded Question from back in Season 6, a neat collector's item for sure. Anyway, that's some of what's going on this week in the game. If you enjoyed or found this helpful, dropping a like or sub would be pretty cool and greatly appreciated. Have a good week. Stay safe and I'll talk to you all later.